It is me, Terry Sarvati, as I stand up my bag with more Resident Evil Village. And, oh boy, was that last episode really, really eventful. Uh, crap. But yeah, who was that episode incredibly eventful because lots of things happened while well, I was just finishing up going around at the house. Well, at that, um, castle place. I can't pronounce that name, but it's the D's house. Let's go with that. <laughs> and then, yeah. And, yeah, apparently Rose is not there. So, looks like we're back to square one, Chiz, so, ha, <laughs> let's roll out of here, because, I mean, boredom, who has anything left to do? What's in here? Nothing. Oh, wait a minute. No. Gosh darn piss nuggets. So, I got this, uh, get out of here time. And yes, I know I need more health. But, am I going this way? Blocked. Oh, I'm going to need some more health juice soon. Like, no exaggerations. But, am I really going in the water for that? <laughs> I know. But yeah, to put it lightly, yes, the last episode was Rose. Last episode was eventful, like really, really eventful. So I'm guessing this is the episode to where things are going to calm down. So I don't get to venture down there. So what's next? Do I use a lockpick for this? I've like two different lockpicks. I don't know if that's if that if I'm supposed to use that. No. No, because I can't open that, right? Wait a second. Nope. Am I supposed to go in there? I have no idea. But the point is, I can't go down there. And pretty sure can't go back in the castle for now because... Oh, do I get to go out this way? Oh! Well, okay then. Fine by me. I don't know what the heck I'm doing. Somebody once told me the world is gonna roll me. I hate the shit. <laughs> because it's an outhouse type. And so I start thinking and I start just making Trek references. Because, yeah. No, you cannot go down there that well. That's bad. What did you do? Oh, God, where the fridge am I supposed to go? That's my question. Because I have no idea where to go from here. 
Then again, y'all know there are those moments in the game to where you get stuck and you're just like, Oh, what fun! I love getting stuck! Because, yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, shoot. I don't have... I don't have a second uh, thing of gunpowder. So, we gon' have to halt on that. Sad. So sad. Isn't that, darling? No, that made no sense. <clears throat> oh my god, where the fridge am I supposed to go? Do I use that iron? I have no idea what the dirty flask is for. <laughs> That's not gonna... Nope. I can't use that here. Nope! Can't use it! Sad. And why would I want to go down there? This is a bad idea waiting to happen. I finished that item that was requested. Please deliver it to the house with the red chimney. Go through the caves into the ruins and down to the village. So the red... So the caves what? Okay, so we gotta venture to, to, into some creepy chiz again? That's not the castle? Oh, great! <laughs> Something about going to the house with a chimney. Whatever that is. Now the question is, where is it? Close the yard house because I said so. <laughs> also, can we give it a round for Ethan for being bland to being such a bland character? It's actually hilarious. You might as well, uh, you might as well just imagine yourself, or put yourself in Ethan's shoes, and, I mean, because Ethan, is, at times, is hilariously bland. That's by no exaggerations. Also, that Duke was a lot of fun. And, um, yeah, sure, if he looked like, as far as, you know, yeah, as much as we, as much as I got that he looked like he was a part of a My 600 pun life, he was probably more, or actually definitely likely the most, the sanest character in that entire castle chase. Because everybody else was going wacko, though we all knew the real deal of what's going on. I can't go up. Are those birdies? I'm gonna need to call Birdie from <laughs> Thomas a friend. Oh yay, this is what I do. I wander around for like uh, eight and a half minutes. Actually it's been ten. But yeah, but I think the one thing I got out of that was that I got gunpowder. Gunpowder for that outhouse. Um <coughs> Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, that really has to happen. Okay, so there is a... Okay, I know there is a note said something I had to look for. Please never deliver it to the house with the red chimney. Go through the caves in the ruins, then down into the village. The caves into the ruins. What? Okay, so there's gotta be a cave to the ruins, or... There, I mean, of course, there's a house with a red chimney. I got that part. I think there's a cave to the ruins, huh? Oh, no. Don't tell me I'm going down there. Nah. Nah. We ain't falling for that shit. No. That don't mean you took fall damage. 
clown head. Can't use this, right? Yeah. So I have no idea what the freak I'm supposed to do down here. Bro, I've been getting stuck on this game more than I've gotten stuck in a fallen order. Hilarious. I'm sure you all know what that's like. It's pure, pure fun. <laughs> Wait, what, what? Who keeps bleach near the kitchen sink? Oh, it's disinfectant wipes. Hey, bro! <laughs> I thought that was bleach. I was like, who in the world keeps bleach near a freaking. Oh my god. Like, yo, that's gross. Why would y'all do that? Ew! Oh, please don't tell me that's the area to the caves that I need to go to because I ain't got no keys to go to the caves if that's where the cave is because I have no idea where I'm supposed to go from here. I mean, I mean, it looks like that letter had a clue of sorts. But to get there is a whole different kind of, uh, trickery that I'm like, what the fridge is going on? Because I'm pretty sure the castle is the last place I should go back into. Because, screw that place. Probably smells of, of death and gym lockers. Okay, hold on for a second while I see what the fridge is going on here. So, hold back.